Hello everyone. I've had a few people inquire about what I typically carry in my camera bag, so I thought I'd make this short little video just to show what I typically carry. Uh, this is the Encase uh, Ari Markopolis bag. I've had it for about a month now. So far I really like it. It's a fairly spacious bag, but not too big. Um, has a handle here, as you can see here, and you just... Uh, yeah, strap it around your back. Has uh, some white balance uh, cards here for for you to use. And then here at the bottom, you got a zipper where you can just put some uh, things that you want to store. It does have a, a rain cover, as you can see here. I keep a lot of my lens caps and everything sitting in here. Some of my lens hoods and so forth. So, so there's that. I'll show you what's inside the bag here in a second. It does have this little uh, entry pouch uh, from the front side, as you can see here. It's got a magnet that holds it down, and a zipper here, as you can see. So I unzip it um, if you want to carry some things, things in the pouch as you can. Um, all I've got right now is one of my uh, rocket blowers to, uh, to, to blow off my lenses and a few other things. You can uh, get access to this pocket from inside the bag, which I'll show here in a second. Let's go ahead and open up the bag, as you can see here. And I have quite a bit, and I'll be honest, when I'm actually traveling, I don't carry all my camera equipment, but I just wanted to give you a, kind of a general idea that this bag is pretty spacious, and you can carry a fair amount of uh, items in here. Right now I have three cameras, uh, my Leica M9, my Olympus OMD, and my Nikon D800E. I also have one Nikon lens. I have three Olympus uh, Micro Four Thirds lenses, and I have three Leica M mount lenses. So, we'll take out the first item, which is my Olympus OMD, as you can see here. Showed this last week. Um, I'll go ahead and show the lenses. I again have my uh, Panasonic 25mm uh, uh, Leica Summilux, as you can see right here. I have the Olympus 12x50 uh, kit lens. And then I also have the uh, Panasonic. 7 by 14 millimeter wide angle lens. Very, very nice lens. So next, we'll show the uh, Nikon D800E. As you can see this, very, very big camera, especially in comparison to my Olympus and my Leica, but so far I like it. Um, you can see that I don't use a typical uh, uh, camera um, uh, holder. I use one of these uh, black rapid um, uh, <clears throat> uh, straps. I've just found a light like this. It's a lot easier to, to carry. I also use this on a tripod a lot. I use a bin row uh, tripod and head and I actually drilled a hole in the side of my tripod mount as you can see here and then placed a real heavy wire so I could strap it on there. Yeah, it does leave a little mark here at the bottom, but um, who looks at that? Nobody. So anyway, I've been doing this for quite a while. I did it when I used to have a Canon 5D Mark II and also with my uh, Canon 7D. So here's the, the really big uh, lens. This is the, you know, the <clears throat> Nikon uh, 14 by 24 millimeter lens. So you can see here f2.8, very wonderful lens to use for landscape. So far I've really, really liked it. It's a huge, I mean huge, huge lens. And last, uh, here's my uh, Leica. This is my Leica M9. You, as you can see here, um, I typically keep my Leica 35 millimeter uh, F1.4 Summilux lens on it I, almost at all times. Absolutely love this lens. It's, uh, the uh, the pictures that you can take are absolutely wonderful. So very very nice lens and camera. Um, I also have move this over for a second. The uh, Leica uh, 21 millimeter uh, Super Elmar lens, as you can see here. 
again, very nice lens uh, for landscape, has very little distortion. Um, the the uh, sharpness is just incredible, literally from the center of your image all the way out to the, to the, uh, the far uh, ends of your image. Absolutely love this. You do have to use um, an extra um, eyepiece uh, viewfinder on your Leica M9 to actually see the entire uh, field of view with this. And I do have it. I can show it here in a second. Last but not least, this is my... Uh, like a 50 millimeter Anacalux lens, uh, again, uh, very big lens, very heavy lens, uh, very un unique lens. It's hard to get a hold of these. Um, shoots at f.95. Absolutely love it. I do use it a lot. Um, a lot of people complain that it's hard to focus. Um, fortunately, I still have pretty good eyesight, so it hasn't been much of an issue. So next, uh, we have just some uh, extra pockets here. As you can see here on the side, I have a pocket that I keep some uh, lens filters in. Get that out of here. I usually will keep one kind of separate, so if I want to put, put it in my uh, uh, pocket, and here's my uh, lens filters. Uh, this is just a uh, cable release used for my Leica M9. Uh, this is an adapter for my Olympus, so I can apply my uh, Leica M mount lenses. So. Again, I usually take that out when I'm traveling, uh, or at least once I get to my destination, and just use the neutral density film or uh, uh, <coughs> filters that I think I'll need that day. Just a small little pouch for my SD cards, as you can see here. Um, this, again, you know, I showed you from the front. You have your uh, the ability to access this little pouch here. And again, this is where you can actually fill it. I have my... Uh, uh, Giotto uh, rocket blower. I have some lens uh, cleaner. Or have a light meter that I just keep in here. Um, I also have a uh, wireless transmitter uh, for my Nikon D800E that I keep in here. I'll show you here real quick. So here's the. Uh, the transmitter, as you can see here in the picture, works really nice. And this is a Twinmate uh, L208 uh, light meter. Don't use it as much as I really should. So that's all it's there. And then last is you do have this little, this one other pouch here. This is where I keep the majority of my my batteries and lights and so forth. So the one thing you didn't see. Um, are my cords for my cameras to charge them. I keep that in a separate pouch uh, that I carry. Um, I did mention that I do keep my 21 millimeter eyepiece for the M9 uh, sitting in this pouch. Um, I have my tripod adapters and uh, Allen wrenches and everything all kept in here also. You know, one other thing I failed to show with this uh, bag also has one last compartment as you can see here. This is on the back side. Um, it will fit your iPad. That's what I have in here. Or I've been told that a few people that you can also fit 11 inch uh, um, MacBook Air in here. So typically I do carry this again to my destination. And then once I'm out traveling I take it out. Thank you.